morning, Dana. Today we have Mariner of the Month, Halloween, and a 210 update. Today is Monday, October 21st, 2024. We asked middle and high school students what they think about when they hear the words Red Ribbon Week. Staying away from drugs. Red ribbons displayed all over school. Making healthy choices for our future. That is true now, but do you know the history of Red Ribbon? In 1985, a DEA agent named Kiki Camarena was kidnapped, tortured, and killed in Mexico, working to prevent drug dealers from bringing drugs into the United States. After his funeral, his friends and family began wearing red ribbons as a way of showing their love of Kiki and their respect for his hard work to keep kids safe, healthy, and drug-free. That led to red ribbon campaign celebrations across the country and eventually a national Red Ribbon Week in 1988. Red Ribbon Week should be educational and fun, but we can't forget to take a moment to honor the memory of DEA agent Kiki Camarena and his family. Thank you, Agent Camarena. We appreciate you, Camarena family. Thanks for your sacrifice, Kiki Camarena. It's Red Ribbon Week this week, and every day there's a different theme. Tomorrow, it's Saddle Up Against Drugs. Dress like a cowboy or cowgirl on Tuesday. On Wednesday, the theme is Looking to a Bright Future. So wear your loudest neon colors. Drugs are despicable on Thursday, so dress like a minion. A yellow shirt is a good option, too. And Friday is a throwback to the 60s. Wear tie-dye on Friday. It's time now for our first Mariner of the Month for October. Good morning, Dr. Warzakin. Good morning, Mr. Long. It's Wear Pink Day. Yes, Wear Pink. I got There's my the shoes. pink shoes. You got a pink bow? Yep. Very good. What are we here for today? Mariner Besides of the Wear Month. Pink. Yeah, Mariner of the Month, sixth grade. Sixth grade. I'm excited to see who it is. Let's, Let's find go. out. Yes, here we go. Good morning, Dr. Taylor's class and everybody in it. You guys know why we're here? You got it right, 100%. Who is our Mariner of the Month for sixth grade in Dr. Taylor's class? Dr. Orzakin? Are we Lots ready for it? Here. Are we ready? Yes. Yes? Mariner of the Month is Ian Zane. Yeah. Come on down. Give Ian a big round of applause. Why did Ian get this? What, what did he do? Ian, you're an incredible Mariner. We're very proud of you. We're proud of your hard work. You're a model student, and we appreciate all that you do to make our community amazing, okay? And you get a cool swag bag full of all kinds of goodies. You get like pop socket thingies and candy. Gift, gift card, all Camp, kinds yes, of great all stuff. All that, the whole nine yards. All so. right, congratulations. Nice. Good morning, friends. <laughs> Look, he's hiding back there. <laughs> Come on. Oh, a nice jersey. <laughs> All right. We've got a special announcement. What are we here for? What are we here for? My goodness. The last sixth grade class knew why we came. So, anyways. Yes. So, Mr. Long, tell us who is our recipient? Vanilla. Yay! Yay! Where is she? Congratulations. Congratulations! Your teachers all got together and chose you as the Mariner of the Month because of your hard work and your great citizenship and all that you do for Dana. So congratulations. You get some cool stuff. Dr. Wazakin, what does she get? You got a swag bag here. You got a certificate, gift cards, candy, great stickers, and a lot of recognition. So we're very proud of you. Can we give her a round of applause again? Good job. All right. Congratulations. This is Shin's the best cheerleader. There's less than two weeks left in the PTSA membership drive and direct donation fundraiser. Eagles are leading the way with memberships at the moment and Bulls are leading for donations. It's not too late to join the Dana PTSA and make a donation. Halloween is just around the corner and ASB is celebrating with a costume contest. If you'd like to enter the costume contest, sign up in the office this week. First place wins $40 Amazon gift card. And the winner will be announced at the Halloween pep rally on October 31st. In 210 News, on Thursday, our girls volleyball team play Oak Avenue and the football team had their last game of the season against Clifton Middle School. Both games are away games. Go Dana! 
For all girls interested in playing 210 League Basketball for Dana, there's an informational meeting at lunch tomorrow in Room 2. Get your lunch and then go directly to Room 2 for the meeting. Tryouts for the JV and Varsity teams are after school on Wednesday. Don't miss the meeting because everything you need to know about tryouts will be shared at the meeting. If you have questions, please see Mr. Lee in Room 20. Audrey, I hope they play Fiend today. But it's Dana News! What? Let's just get started with the birthdays. Happy birthday today to JJ Hamblin, Tyler Lee, and Juliana Zhu. Happy birthday tomorrow to Aim Wang, Weston Ting, and Mega Z. And on Wednesday to Aiden Lee. That's all the announcements for today. Have a Have great day. Have a wonderful day. day. Bye. 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 Bye.